Good morning, everyone. How are you today? Good morning, teacher. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Okay, let's start today's session. And we're going to start by checking the objectives, okay? We're going to go with the specific one and then with the class objective, okay? Now, here we go. It says, participants use jobs vocabulary. Repeat, participants. Participants. Use, use jobs vocabulary. Use jobs vocabulary. vocabulary. To describe. To describe, to describe. To describe. Do this at work. Do this at work. Okay, very good. Now we have today's class objective. What we're going to do in today's class. Lo que vamos a hacer ahora en clase. Participants role play a conversation. Participants. Participants. Role play. Role play, role play a conversation. A conversation. Using, 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 yes, yes no, no yes, questions, aha, uh -huh. talking, talking, talking about, about, talking about daily, daily routine. routine. Very good, guys. Okay, daily routine. This week is about daily routine. So, let's start. We're going to start with some new vocabulary. Okay, you guys repeat after me. All right, we have. Picture number one, dance. Repeat. Dance. 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 All right. Picture number two, drive. 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 Okay, very good. Picture number three, listen to music. Listen, listen to, music. to music. Very music. good. Very good. Play basketball. Play basketball. Play basketball. Play basketball. Play basketball. Okay. Picture number five, read. 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 Yes. Very good. Picture read. number six, ride a bike. Ride a bike. Ride a bike. Ride, ride a bike. Uh -huh. Ride a bike. Suena todo junto. Ride a bike. 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 Very good. Now, the next one, run. 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 Very run. good. And... Number eight, shop. 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 Very good. Shop. Okay. Shop. Very good. Let's practice. This time, you read the verbs for me. These eight pictures are verbs, they are actions. Similar to when you say, I take a shower, I have breakfast, I go to work. Okay. They are the same. They are actions. Very good. Now, let's see. Image number one. Three, two, one, go. Image number one. Dance. Dance. Number two. Try. Three. Listen to music. Very good. This one sounds listen, listen. Listen. Exactly. Listen. Very good. Next. Play basketball. Play basketball. basketball. Okay. The next one. Really? Really? Very good. The next one? Ride a bike. Ride a bike. Yes. Number seven? From. And number eight? Shop. 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 Very good. Okay. Some, some other four. Okay. Repeat after me. Study. 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 Mm -hmm. Study. Swim. 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 You see, letter W, letter W in this case sounds like you swim, swim. 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 Okay, swim. very good. Now, the number three over here, take a walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. Take a walk. Yes, take a walk. The L, the letter L doesn't sound over here. Take a walk. A walk. Take a walk. A walk. Okay, a walk. and the last one. Watch a movie. Watch a movie. Watch a movie. Watch a movie. Very good. Very good. Okay. Very good. Okay. It's your turn. 
Three, two, one. Number one. Study. Study. The next one. Swim. Swim. Very good. The next Swim. one. Take a walk. Take a walk. And the last one. Watch movie. movie. Very good. You see, there is a letter T over here, and we need to pronounce it. Watch. 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 Yeah. Watch. Perfect. Okay. Very good. What are we going to do with this verse? Okay. We're going to make questions. Similar. Give me a second. I want to get there. Okay. Similar to the questions over here, okay. We use this picture in another class, okay? But this is the example for the next activity, all right. I want you to write questions with do or does, okay? But we're going to use the verbs from the pictures. Run, what are the verbs from the pictures? Run. Ride. Uh-huh, what else? Yes, give some more examples. Yes, perfect. Uh -huh. Play basketball. Very good. Okay, so you're going to use the verbs from the pictures to ask questions. Okay, how many questions? You are going to give me five questions using do and five questions with us. Okay, now okay. what subject pronouns, what subject pronouns do we use with auxiliary do? What subject pronouns do we use? We use subject pronoun you, and what mm. others? We, we, I, uh -huh. I we, and? They. Yes, they. perfect. Okay, and what subject pronouns do we use with auxiliary does? He, 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 he. Perfect, there you go. Okay, how many questions do I want? Quantas, how many? Cinco, um, five. Five, and, and? And five and do is five and does. <laughs> yes, five and five. Okay, a total of questions. What's the total? The total, el total. What's the total? Ten. Ten, Ten. Ten. right? Ten. Ten. All right, total. I'm going to send you a message. Total. All right, the total Four. is? Total. Yes, Ten. Four. Okay, very good. So we're going to work in groups. Do you have, do you have the pictures? Do you have nope. the pictures? No? Okay, let me, let me show you. Do you prefer to send the pictures in the WhatsApp group or yeah. or I show you the pictures like this? Take one. You take a picture? Let's yes, go. yes. Okay, give me a second. Okay, this is the first one. You can take a screenshot. And this is the next one. Okay. Are you ready? Ready. Okay, here we go. All right. Good, good, good. That's awesome. Okay, let's make the groups here. Here we go. Vaya, devuelve todo esto. ¿Cuál sería la primera? Tú. Ahorita, ahorita. Soy Chris, my friend. La primera sería esa. Esas. Ajá. O 
podía ser... Ay, vamos a ver. Me comenzaría como I do. Si sí, vamos a usar el do, creo que el do va primero. Sería yo. Pero... <coughs> Vale, como aquí, aquí tengo un ejemplo yo, donde dice, do you, do? Eh, pongámosle, dance, every day. Sería, tú, do you do? usted baila todos los días. Do you dance? Do you dance? Do you dance? Every day. Vale, entonces sería la primera. Do you, Do you dance? Do you dance every day? Every day. Mm -hmm. La otra, do you listen your music in the morning? Bien. ¿Tú escuchas, escuchas tu música en la mañana? Sí. ¿Tú Yo escuchas música en la mañana? Listen to music in the morning. Okay. Or in supermarket or in uh, in super. You eat shop in supermarket. Uh, supermarket. Bah. Ya están las cinco. Hoy me toca eh, la primera, la entrada. Uh -huh. Does he take a, take a walk in city in a, in a, in, in a city? La, Se les repito. Sí. 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 Does he Take a word in a city, in a city. That is take. a city. Uh, take a word, take a, take a word in a city. Eh, perdón, es as in a city, Evo. No solamente es in city, but in the city. But. ¿Cómo sería ahí? Good, good job. Yes, in a city. Good. Okay. Thank in you. a city. Uh, take, take a yeah. walk. You can say take a walk in a city or in the city. In the city, which would be like in la ciudad, and if you say in a city, it's like saying in una ciudad. So it okay. depends on what you want to say. Ah, okay, yes. okay, gracias. You're welcome. Toca eh, Jorge. Espera, vaya, vaya. Si quieres, este. David, si ¿Ya? querés, danos, danos la que vea tenía de primero para tenerlas ah, iguales. Ajá, para tenerlas ah, iguales. Do you listen music? Ajá, listen music, pa. Yes. Vaya. Compartí la pantalla de ver los otros verbos para tenerlos ahí también. Ah, ya guardaron ese. Sí, sí. Ah, sí, ahorita, ya estuvo. Ahorita, ahorita, ahorita. Ay, chicos. Sí. Vaya, quiero ver. Mm. Ah, sí, va. Ahí estaba listening to music. Ajá. Do you do listen to music? 
La segunda sería, does, does he, does he drive a truck? Armemos primero para llevar en orden si quiere y para no perdernos. La Ajá, la Ajá, tú. Ajá, para no perdernos. Dale, tú. Do you have, o oh, do you I, para ya no usar el you. Ajá. Do I... Do I dance? No. Drive. No, pero el do, you, do, do I no, no, no. No. Do I, I no. Me? Sí, ajá. Ser, do they shop in the market? Vaya, ahí podríamos... Do they shop in the market? Puede ser por lo que están comprando en, en el supermercado. Entonces, do I good idea, a... very good. Mm -hmm. Hey, today. today. Yeah, no. Yes or no? Lo ponemos o no? Sí, sí, sí. Yes, sí. yes. Está bien. Así todo llevamos bien. ¿Sería en el supermercado o en el supermercado o en el supermercado? En el supermercado, le puse yo. En el supermercado. ¿Do they shop in the market? Así, ah, sí. Yes. You can say in otra? the market, but the difference is that the supermarket, in the, in the picture, it's a supermarket. Yes, it's a yes. The other one on the street is the market, right? But the, the, market. the question is okay. The question is okay, okay? Okay. Right. Otra que podríamos poner sería, do you like uh, a ride bike? ¿Te gusta andar en bicicleta? Okay, okay. Sí. Do you like a ride bike? Uh -huh. Do you like... Do you like uh -huh. to ride? Uh -huh. Ride a like. bike. Like. Like. Uh -huh. like, te gustar. Do you like to ride a bike? Creo que es que cero no. Uh -huh. Sí. Sí, es verdad. Do we play? ¿Cómo la pusieron ustedes? Uh, do you like to ride a bike? Ride a bike. Ride a bike. Bye. Bye. Uh, the she ride a bike. ¿Cómo se dice parque en inglés? Yard, ¿verdad? Park. ¿Madre? ¿Cómo? Park. 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 No es yard. Ah, no, yard es jardín, va. In the park. ¿Qué sí sería, va? Sí. Va. Mm, Va, entonces ya tenemos las cinco. Si quiere, este, la, si quiere la pronuncia, la, ahí está, par. Ok, thank you, teacher. Vaya, mira, eh, la voy a leer yo las cinco con tú y Margarita las otras cinco con das y después la tú las otras cinco, las otras cinco. ¿Estamos ahí? Está bien, está bien. Hola. Vaya, eh, la primera sería, do you study today? Do they dance in Saturday? Do you swing in the pool? Do you drive always? Do we shop in a supermarket? Okay. Todo Margarita. Um, does it take a work in a city? Does he study English? Does she watch a movie in a cinema? Does she listen to hip hop? Does she ride a bike in the park? As you think? Yes. Wonderful. Very good job. Okay. I want to check three questions. All right. The first one is when we have a day of the week, when we say Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Saturday, we use the preposition on. So when, when I say, uh, I take a class on 
Monday, on Tuesday, on Saturday. Okay, so can you repeat the question where you have the name of a day? Today dance uh -huh. on so, Saturday. There you go. We're always going to use on when we have a day of the week. Okay. Now, okay. in the next one, when you have the word always, always, okay, we're going to say, do you always? Does she always? Always, always goes after the subject pronoun. So, okay. can you repeat the question one more time? Do you dry always? Do you always dry? Yes, very good. Do you always? Always, always goes after the subject pronoun. Very good. And, oh, pronunciation, pronunciation. The verb, I'm going to send you a message. The verb walk over here, we pronounce it like, like when we say China walk. Do you know China walk, the restaurant? Yes. So, walk, walk, walk. walk. Listen, walk, 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 walk. 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 It's like saying the K sound at the end. Walk, walk. There you go. Okay, those are perfect questions. Very good. Okay, I want to go check the other groups. Give me one minute, okay? Okay. okay. Uh, okay. Y así significaría, decís? Para el trabajo. Para el trabajo. Sí, así me dice aquí. Sí, Pero sí, no sí. Go to work. Go to work. Do you need some ¿Cómo? help? How can I help you? Repeat, teacher. How can I help you? ¿Qué quieren decir? ¿Cómo les puedo ayudar? How does, can I help you? Uh -huh. Does she drive? Uh -huh. At work. Oh. In or to work? To work. To work. To, to work. Right, to Does work. She drive to work. Yes, very good. Para el trabajo significaría. In this case, a el, a el trabajo. When you say, ah. I go, I go to school. I go to the supermarket. I go to my house. So, preposition to. Cuando es de movilizarse a un lugar, vamos a ocupar to. I go to the beach. Yo voy a la playa. Okay. Okay. Right. Entonces, en el de basketball. Uh -huh. Quiero ver, ahí tenemos. Eran dos. ¿Cómo? Eran dos imágenes, veo. Sí, sí. Solo, solo una tenemos ahí ahorita. I can send you the other image. Give me a second. Ajá, pero que hagamos con la otra imagen. Ajá, está bien. Give me one con second. la otra imagen yo puse Does he swim every day? Oh, you have the other pictures. Okay. Does... One second. Mm. That's his thing. That's that's his dream. Every day. Tenemos dos tristes. Yo que los tres éramos. Ah. Los dos tristes están aquí. Yo pego los tres éramos. Ah, ey, habemos otro. Habemos otro. Sí, sí. sí hay un Cristian Fuentes. Pues. Ah. <risa> Exacto. Como solo los tres primeros estamos. <risa> ¿Qué onda, Cristian? ¿Qué hubo? ¿Qué hubo? No, hombre, no me escuchan ahí. <risa> Como no te dejan de estar hablando con usted. Yo vi una no, extraña por ahí. Pues. Sí, fíjate que como, como no te veía la, la foto, no, no tenés la cámara en pero yo pensaba que, que siempre nosotros estábamos. Uh, study. Mm. Ah, swing, mira, ajá, cabal. Uh. Eh, la otra que puse yo, este, todo es he, room, y the park. O das. Das, 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 das
Así. Does Decir. he ride a bike in the street? Uh -huh. Bike. Vale, con ocho aviones todo el, todo el más voy a trabajar, le digo. Ok. Now, what are the instructions for the next activity? You ask the questions that you have to eat to one another. Ok, for example, what is one of your questions? Question number one. Do you study today? Ok, do you study today? Ok. So, for example, Jorge, do you study today? Uh, yes, I do. Okay, very good. So ask the questions to one another in the group. All right, go ahead. Okay, okay. Vaya, señores. Pocas palabras, trabajemos. Vaya, eh, yo le voy a decir, <laughs> si quiere, le voy a, le voy a leer las preguntas eh, a uno por uno. Eh, primero a Margarita, después a, a Jorge y luego a Fabricio. ¿Estamos mm. ahí? Vaya, okay. eh... Ana, eh, ah, no, pero no, no puedo preguntar a Ana. A Ana no, Ana le voy a preguntar las últimas, la de Dase mejor. <ríe> Se salvó Ana. Vaya, no. eh, le voy a preguntar, bueno, igual, igual, vamos a hacer caso que ustedes, que ustedes es uno y uno. Vaya. Eh, Ana, do you study, do, do she study today? Yes, I do. Ok. Can you repeat the question one more time? Eh, Ana, eh, ah, es cierto, es cierto. Ana, no, 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 no. Ah, pues no. Vamos this a comenzar is, así con los... is, uh, Sí, sí, es que es, question, es, right. es, ajá. You can ask Ana, do you study today? It's okay. Right. Now, if you want to say does she, sí, sí, you sí, have sí, to ajá, ask cabal. Fabricio or Jorge, right? Ajá, ajá, cabal, cabal. No, sí, sí, mm -hmm. es cierto. Okay. Vaya. One more time. Eh, no, Vamos, Jorge, Jorge, uh, do you study today? Yes, I do. Okay. Uh, Fabricio, uh, muchachos, uh, boys, do they dance on Saturday? No, I do. don't. Fabricio? No, I don't. He said Jorge. the the boys, do they, the boys, other people, right? So. Do they? Oh, no. Do they? Uh, so in the question, he says, "Do they?" The other people, right? They. The other boys. So in the answer, we say, "No, no what?" And no, what's the subject pronoun? No, uh -huh. no, they know. They? No, they oh. know. What's the negative form no. of "do"? The negative form is "don't." Do. No, they, no, no, they don't. Okay, one more time. No, they. No, they don't. Oh, very good. They don't. Okay. Very good. Continue. Okay. Uh, Jorge, uh, do you swing in the pool? No, I don't. Okay. Uh, Jorge, do you always drive? Okay. How are you guys doing? Hello. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Read your questions for me. Mm. Creo que no. No. Are you ready with the 10 questions? Yes. Okay, read the questions. Do you dance every day? Do you listen to music in the morning? Do they watch a movie? Watch a movie in the house? Do they room in the park? Do they shop in the supermarket? Very good, very good job, very good. Okay, the other questions? Does she swing in the pool? Does she read at night? Does she read a bike in the street? Does she drive to work? Does 
he played basketball in the park. Wonderful. Very good job. Very good. Just pronunciation for the verb swim. 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 Very swim. good. Very good. Okay. What's the instruction for the next activity? Okay. You ask your questions to one another. For example, what's question number one, Fabricio? Uh, sorry, Fernando. What's question number one? Do you dance every day? Okay. Ruben, answer the question. Answer the question. Um, does, does she... The answer, the answer. Do you dance every ah, day? Ah, the answer. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh, Sería... No... Uh-huh. No, I... No, I don't. Very good. Okay. Good job. Porque, right. Porque si dice today. Oh, but he said do you. I heard do you dance. Mm -hmm. Do you dance do every day? Do you uh -huh. dance every day? No, because, I don't porque no bailo. Uh-huh. So it's, if the question is you, no, I don't. No, but if you say they, for example, other people, right? Other group. For example, Herbert, Anna, and David. Okay. Do they do they dance every day? Yes or no? What do you think? Mm, no. Okay. So in this case, we say no? No. Subject pronoun? David. They. Anna. Uh -huh. no, they. No, they. No, they dance. They. No. Uh, auxiliary? Negative auxiliary? No, no, they, they, no, they not. Let me help you. No, they, no, no, they, no, 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 creo que no va a ser. No, she does. Doesn't. No. Ah, uh, she doesn't, right? But when we have subject pronoun they, no, no they, they, no, they doesn't. Look, no, they do not. Uh -huh. Do not or contraction, don't, right? Yes? Remember, uh, remember, no, when I say yes, I do or no, I don't, this, this subject pronoun I can change. Este sujeto lo puedo cambiar. Esta estructura es para los sujetos. ¿Para cuáles sujetos? Sujeto I, Dura. sujeto... You, uh -huh. I do, we, they. Ah, okay. So if the answer is no, they, no, they? If we don't. Uh -huh. In this case, we say no, they don't. Okay. Now, mm -hmm. si yo uso un sujeto, he, she, or it, if I use subject pronoun, he, she, or it, and I have a positive answer, yes? No, yes, she does. Or we she say does. no? No, no, she doesn't. Does. Uh -huh. does Very good. Very good. So let's practice. Okay. Right now, we ask your questions to one another. Okay. Ask your questions. Okay. Go ahead. We're going to practice. Do you listen to music in the morning, Javi? No, I don't. Así sería la respuesta. Okay. Depende si, si, si escuchas o no. No, ahí no. Pero está bien la respuesta, o sea, le quiero decir no. Yes, it's correct. Ok. Do, do they read at night? Do they ride? Do they ride a bike? Ride a, ride a bike? Do no. they ride? Ride es de leer. Right. Oh, you want to say read. Okay, read this like this. Read. Let me, sh let me send you the pronunciation. Read here in the message. And the other one, ride a bike, is like this. Right. Do, do they read at night? Mm -hmm. Yes. No. I don't. He said they, they, do they? They. Uh -huh. They, for Pero example, they, they, is... uh -huh, they like Ana, Javier, uh -huh. uh, so, 
So, no, what's the answer? No, they. Uh huh. No, they am dasa. No, no, don't. No, no they. I. I don't. No, I they. don't. No, they. I don't. No, they. No, they. <laughs> it's okay. Don't. No, they don't. Very good. Very no, good. No, they don't. Yes, very good. Okay, don't worry. It's okay. So, no, they don't, right? Okay, let's practice more. One more. Go ahead. Uh, does she try to work? Okay. The teacher, for example, the teacher. Does she? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh, teacher, teacher. And I say no. So, what's the answer? Uh, does he... Oh, Play the basketball. Answer, the answer, the answer. What's the ah, answer? The answer. Uh-huh. Repeat the question. Does she? Does she try to work? Mm -hmm. So, I say answer no. Seria. What's the answer? Mm -hmm. No. Yes. No, I doesn't. No, no, doesn't. Shh. No, she no. doesn't. No, no, she, she doesn't. doesn't. No, she doesn't. Yes, very good. No, she doesn't. Very good. Okay, continue, continue, all right, practice. I want to check other groups. Okay. Doki, doki. Hello, hello, are you ready? Yes. Okay, yes. I, want to check, yes. I want to check your questions. Okay, okay. Voy a leer la du yo, si quieren, y otro más, la dos, la das. Okay. Okay. La do serían, teacher. Do listen, do, do listen to music? One. Can you repeat it one more time? Do you. Do you, do you listen to music? Very good. Okay, continue. Uh -huh. Do they shop in the market? Do you ride bike? Do I drive a truck? A truck? Truck? Truck. 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 Uh, track. Do we play basketball? Five question. Okay. Very good, very good. Okay, the other five. David, o lo digo yo. Le he leído, doctor. Does Does she read a book? Does he swim every day? Does he run in the park? Does she dance salsa? Does dog take a walk? What's the last one? The last one? One more time. La does, does dog take a walk? The the dog. Okay. The dog. Oh, oh, the oh. dog. Like this. Very good. Okay. Very good. I just have one observation about pronunciation. Uh, when you go like in in uh, in la bicicleta, ride a bike, the pronunciation is like this. Oh, ride a ride a bike, ride a bike, ride a bike, ride a bike. Okay, there you. Teacher. okay. Thank you. Thank What's you. the next activity? Okay, ask your questions to one another. For example, what's question number one? One more time. Question number one. Uh, do you listen to music? Okay, Hector. What's the answer? The answer, do you listen to music? Yes or no? Yes, yes. Full answer, yes? Yes, I do. There yes, you go. I do. Uh -huh. Okay, yes, I do. ask the questions to one another, okay? okay. Go ahead, go ahead. Uh, Hector, do I yes. drive a truck? Um, no, I don't. I don't. Oh, repeat, oh. repeat the question. Sorry, repeat the question. Do I drive a truck? Do you? It, he said, Do I? Do I? <laughs> so it's about David. The question is about David. So, so in the answer, Como la está preguntando a mí, tiene que cambiarle el verbo. Exacto, ahí tendrías que cambiarle. Ahí tendrías que cambiarle la persona. Pero él está preguntando Pero acerca de él. Ah, sí, Entonces, okay, okay, si yes, la yes. pregunta es acerca de él, ¿usted le dice? No. No, en the subject pronoun. 
You. 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 And the auxiliary? You don't. Yes, perfect. Okay. The question is valid. For example, do I do I teach do I teach um Spanish? Do I teach Spanish? Yes or no? No, no right. No. No, no. I she teach English. No. Right. She does not. She but does. I am but I am asking I. Do I? Uh, yo estoy hablando con ustedes. Entonces la respuesta okay. es you. You, right? No. Yes. You? you? Don't. 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 Very good, very good. Okay, Stay. continue, Stay. continue, yes. Christian, do they shop in the market? Pero, ¿cuál, es de lo, cuál de los dos? Porque estamos los dos acá. Ah, Christian López. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Christian López, do they shop in the market? Yes, yes. Eh... They, <laughs> yeah. They yes. Ah, yeah, yeah. Esa, esa estaba buscando. Sí, sí, sí. Esa estaba buscando. Esa estaba buscando. Yes, they. Yes, I do. Oh. They do. No. In this no. case, we we change the subject pronoun. Uh, Recuerden que yes they yes they do. Uh -huh. Esta es la estructura yes. para los sujetos. Para cuáles sujetos? Exactly. I. I you. You. Uh -huh. We. They. They. We. they. Yes? yes they okay. do. This, they this do. picture this picture is in WhatsApp in your WhatsApp group. Okay. Yeah. You can check it. I want to check uh, another group. Okay. Continue pra practice. Okay. Okay. Eh, Cristian Fuentes. Los básicos son cuatro módulos. Hello, hello. Hello, Question. teacher. Hello, teacher. How can I help you? Eh, teacher, en español, eh, ¿verdad que cuando estamos hablando de una cosa eh, podemos ocupar it cuando solo señalamos o también podemos, podemos mencionar también la cosa? En este caso, si hablamos de un perro, el ejemplo que dio Ana, eh, that car is, is eh, a blap, o podemos decir, that's it, a blap. Let's see, can you repeat the, can you repeat the question? Eh, that's, mm -hmm. that's it, a blap. Estamos señalando el perro. Y, pero ah, cuando también decir, ¿Qué es lo que quieren preguntar? Si el, perro, si el perro es negro. Ah, ok. ¿Cuál verbo estamos ocupando ahí? ¿Estamos eh, ocupando el verbo ser o estar? Ser. Uh -huh. Ser o estar. Entonces, ¿cómo digo ser o estar en inglés? ¿Cuál es el verbo? To, to be. To be, right. Ok. Y el verbo to be tiene una conjugación diferente. Ese no es un verbo de acción. Ese representa ser o estar. Entonces, ¿cómo hago una pregunta con el verbo to ah. be? The, the is. Sorry, is right. So I say oh. is subject pronoun. Black. Teacher, is. teacher, una, una pregunta, teacher. Uh -huh. Tell me. Uh -huh. y para hacer y para hacer una oración así con el verbo con el con <laughs> is pero en acción así como las que estamos haciendo preguntas directas. En este caso no se puede porque estamos hablando de actividades y el, las actividades. No se puede. Las actividades no se mezclan con el cero estar. Es igualito que en español. Ah, bueno. Si usted dice, por ejemplo, yo como eh, pupusas, por ejemplo. Uh -huh. Entonces, ahí no estoy metiendo el verbo to be. No lo necesito. No necesito describir nada que sea cero estar. Entonces, solo voy a conjugar el verbo. Yo como pupusas. Ella come pupusas. Uh -huh. She eats pupusas. Ahora bien. El verbo to be es algo diferente. El verbo to be, ¿para qué lo usamos la semana pasada? ¿Se acuerdan? La semana pasada no vimos verbos de acción. Solo vimos adjetivos. ¿Qué más? Adjetivos. Ajá, adjetivos y las occupations, right? Occupations, yes? Mm -hmm. Tell me, Ana. Eh, teacher, entonces, si queremos hacer una pregunta con respecto a una cosa... Eh, para usar el das, habría que utilizar en la pregunta un verbo. Si usted quiere ocupar un verbo, obligadamente tiene que ocupar das. Si usted quiere ocupar un verbo de acción, comer, saltar, dormir, tiene que ser das. 
Si usted va a ocupar un adjetivo o una ocupación para su pregunta, va a ocupar el verbo to be. Por ejemplo, usted quería preguntar si el gato era negro. Uh -huh. La palabra negro es un adjetivo, es una cualidad. Entonces, ahí le va a decir, is the cat black? Porque no es una uh -huh. acción, no estoy preguntando de correr, dormir, trabajar. Entonces, ahí uh -huh. sí va el to be. Okay, teacher. Thank you. For example, let's practice. If you want uh -huh. to use, if you want to use um, the word, the word doctor. Okay. What is a question you can ask with the doctor, with the word doctor? This is an occupation, and we use the verb to be with occupations. So, mm -hmm. what is a question I can ask? Uh -huh. A. Uh huh. Very good. A doctor. Very good. Is he a doctor? Mm -hmm. Now, if I want to use the verb go, okay, how do I ask a question with the verb go? I go to the movie. Okay, we start with the auxiliary. And the auxiliary mm -hmm. is do or does? Does. Ah, okay, does. Uh, do, do I go to the movie? Do I go? Okay. Very uh, good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, very good. Okay, teacher, gracias. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right, you're welcome. Okay. Okay. I go to the movie. Uh -huh. Do you go to the movie? I go to the movie. Yes, yes, cabal. Cabal, el duro vamos a ocupar solamente cuando estemos ocupando dos verbos. Ya tú me preguntaba, pero Okay, we're back in the main session. And after we practiced, after we practiced, let's do a quick review before our last activity of today's class. Now, remember, when we have subject pronouns, again, When we have, when we have subject pronouns, I, okay, es, en este ejercicio el único ejemplo es, es con I, pero yo puedo ocupar este, esta forma para hacer preguntas con el sujeto I, you, we, they, okay. It's the same, it's the same structure, okay. Esa es la misma estructura. Para estos cuatro sujetos. I, mm -hmm. you, we, they. we, they. When it's a positive sentence, when it's a positive answer, sorry. Yes, I do. Yes, we do. Yes, they do. Yes, you do. Okay. Mm -hmm. When it's negative, no, I don't. No, we don't. No, they don't. No, you don't. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, this is the structure for subject pronouns. He, she, it. Yes? It. Okay. Yes. So, si yo quiero hacer una pregunta, if I, uh, if I want to ask a question, I have to, uh, I have to say does in the beginning. Esa es la estructura de una pregunta. Obligadamente, tengo que empezar una, pre una pregunta con el auxiliar. So, I say does, does he, does she, does it. Okay, now, and then I have the verb, have, eat, work, make, and the complement. 
vegetables, food on Saturdays. It's the rest of the information. Now, if it's a positive answer, yes, she does. Yes, he, he, yes. Or no, she doesn't. Or no, he doesn't. Okay. Or no, it, it doesn't. There you go. Okay. This is the structure for action verbs, verbos de acción, okay? Drink, listen to music, drive, swim, okay? Any action verb, we use this structure. Okay, what are the instructions for the next activity and the last activity of today's class? Okay, we're going to work in groups. Instructions. Okay, let's see. Repeat after me. Working groups. Working groups. Working group. Working group. Working group. Okay. And and make a conversation. And make a and make a conversation. Okay. With yes, no questions. Yes, no questions. Okay. Very good. Everybody, everybody, repeat everybody. 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 Must participate. Must participate. participate. Okay, participate. very good. Todos deben de participar. So everybody participates. Okay. Now, what information are you going to include? Okay. We're going to use the questions. Use the questions from the previous practice, okay? Let's see. Okay, use the questions. Repeat, use the questions. Use the questions. From the previous practice, repeat. From, from the, the previous practice. practice. And um, action verbs. Action verbs. And action verbs. And action verbs. From work activities. From work activities. Okay, ¿qué quiere decir? Que para las preguntas de la conversación vamos a mezclar los verbos, lo, los verbos de las preguntas que hicimos en el ejercicio anterior, más verbos de acción de su trabajo, okay? That is something you already know. So, a conversation, okay? Short conversation, go ahead. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. mm, no, but here we go. Come on, you're ready. You're ready. You know the verbs. Okay, so here we go. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Tell me. Tell me the instructions. Uh -huh. Work in groups. Work okay, group. make and, and make, a make a conversation. With what information? With what information? With yes, With yes and no questions. No questions. Yes, no questions. Uh -huh. From the Everybody. previous... And we use action verbs from activities at work. Very good, very good. Okay, here we go. Read. Read. In. Joker. Joker. Uh -huh. Joker. Do you read the Jotcars? The Jotcars. Yeah, I contest us. Yes, I do. No. Mm -hmm. Sí, yes, I do. Yes, yeah, I, I do. do. Yes, I do. De ahí otra podría ser la de um, pongamos una das así como que estamos hablando nosotros, Rubén, y, y le decimos, y, y te digo yo eh, a Javi, ¿va? Uh -huh. Doesn't he 
drive to work. Ajá. Uh -huh. Does, does he, does, does he drive to work? Does he. Uh -huh. Pero dijo que no teníamos que incluir todo, pero ¿cómo podemos hacer una conversación así? Vaya, porque es que si, no sé si para hacer una conversación creo que tendríamos que... Hay que empezar con el saludo. Para la ocupación, baja y todo eso. Ajá. Porque en todo caso entonces tendríamos que decirle, va, que cuál es la ocupación a Fernando, va. What is your occupation, Fernando? Y ya aquel, ah. Yes, good idea, very good. Good idea. Ya cuando Fernando nos diga que es coordinador, entonces yo le puedo preguntar, va, do you read the job card, Fernando? Y ya aquel, ah, yes. Y yes. ahí tú. Y, y ya me contesta, digamos que y ya digamos yo le puedo preguntar a Javier va la misma cuál es su ocupación va y ya después le puedo preguntar do you store tools eh, in warehouse en almacén y usted dice nice to meet you to eh, Fabricio uh -huh. y o sea los dos contestan al mismo tiempo no importa si uno lo hizo más rápido otro más corto pero al final usted uh -huh. va a contestar nice to meet you too va, y ahí termina ahí ya termina uh -huh. la, 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 la la, esta, esta saludo. los saludos uh -huh. cabal, porque yo veo que los demás grupos suelen saludarse se va todo el, todo, <risa> toda la conversación todo el diálogo, <risa> sí. <risa> vaya eh, uh -huh. vaya entonces de repente eh, puede ser que Fabricio le pregunte va Fabricio vos te vos le preguntas a, a Anita va ojo oh, Fabricio vos vas a, vas a preguntar eh, le preguntarle ¿Cómo le van? El, eh, ¿Qué es lo que hacen? Su, ¿Qué es lo que hacen el trabajo? ¿Qué es lo que hace? Eh, Sería, si trabaja, no, trabaja, si trabaja en Aromán. Eh, si, trabaja, si trabaja en Aromán. Eh, ¿Does she work in Aromán? ¿Do you work? Uh, así, ¿Do you work? ¿Do you work in Aromán? Uh, uh, yes, I do. Uh, eh, sería, eh, sería eh, ¿Qué hace? La pregunta es ¿Qué hace? Como, ¿Qué pasa, ¿qué hace? ¿Cómo sería que era? Ya voy a hablar yo con la teacher. Le voy a explicar el motivo. Bueno, Hola, ¿y si me tiene okay? uh, oh, Teacher, ya voy a escribirle a usted para explicarle el okay. motivo de mi salida de la reunión. Okay. Pero para que a la hora que tome ahí nota del de, de listado de quienes estuvieron. Para... Ok, no te preocupes. No te preocupes. No te preocupes. Ok, thank you, teacher. All right. Hector, do you read a book? Yes, we well, uh, no. No, no, I no. don't. Yeah. No, I don't. No, I don't. Right, luego. Hector. Coma das. Javier. Ve, right, escúchame, Hector. Ahí voy con la pregunta. Sí. Dale, dale. Hector, das Javier. Coordinate the Bionics Group? No, he doesn't. Eso, bro, bro. No, he... Awesome, that's great. Yes. Does the question I... and the answer, they are great. Javier. 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 Well, Javier. Solo uno hay, Cristian, hay dos, o no? <laughs> <risa> ¡Qué, va... <risa> Qué valor! Javier, ¿do you clean work area? Pues Javier, si no tenemos Javier acá. Javier, I think Javier is not here. Javier. We only have no, 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 no. Christian, Christian Fuentes. Christian. What? <laughs> Christian, <laughs> do you clean work area? Yes, I do. Okay. 
Javier está en otro grupo, ya me acordé. <risa> David, es que se parecen los dos. No, 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 tampoco, tampoco. David, ¿does he swing every day? No, I don't. No, oh, no. Does he swing every day? Does no, he swing every day? No, I don't. He is saying he. Maybe you ah, can say he, you can ah, say the yes. name the name of the person, okay. maybe? Uh, no. No, he doesn't. Mm -hmm. No, he doesn't, Hector. Bueno, está la pregunta porque no era. Tu turno, David, de preguntar. Espérame, estoy poniendo la pregunta. Bueno, bueno. Hector. Yes. Do you remove part? Yes, I don't. Totally. Yes, I do. David, does Christian keep, keep a record of tool? No. He doesn't. Okay. Es Christian. Christian. Hello, hello. Does David keep a record of tool? Does what? What? Repeat the question, please. Does Does David keep a record of tool? Yes, he does. Okay. We do study English. Yes, we do. Yes. Como pregunta no sería do we? Uh, yes, do we study English? Okay. Okay, also. ¿Seguimos haciendo más preguntas o? ¿Qué más? Oh, si quieren preguntemos no, los que ya teníamos para ir agarrando el hilo. Review. Review Calibration Tool, ponele. Do you review? Ajá. Calibration, Calibration. Tool, Javi. Yo te diría ahí, yes, I do. Y ya, digamos, ahí podríamos meter una para que él diga que no lo hace, va. Como no hay don. No sé si le podrías preguntar sería, vos o, otra. Sería, que... eh, ajá, yo le preguntaría. Eh, Javi, eh, you assist in mechanic? No, I don't. Ah, cabal. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, y ahí terminemos. Ah, oh, ok. Very good. Bye, ya. Yeah. Espérame. No. I don't. 
No, I don't. Ok. Vaya, estas son... Ahora, Javi, conmigo. Ajá. Vaya, ¿qué te voy a preguntar? Uh -huh. do, you, do you clean tu área? Así. ¿Les parece? Oh. Do you go to dance on do, Saturday? No, no Mm. Do you no, go no to tiene mucho sentido. Eh, me pregunta si vamos, si vamos a ir a, si vamos a ir a bailar, a bailar el sábado. Do you go to dance on Saturday? Eh, van a ir a bailar el sábado. Entonces, yeah. yo voy a decir, yes, yes, I do, yes, I do, lo que ustedes contestan. Entonces, ahí usted, Margarita, al final, entonces dice, ah, pues, ok, see you later. Eh, nos vemos, nos vemos. Y ahí termina la. Ahí termina. Yeah. ¿Cómo sería? Es que no, esa pregunta no la he entendido muy bien, la última. Que es... Vaya, eh, y ustedes van a ir a bailar, eh, van a ir a bailar, es, van a ir a bailar el sábado. Primero nos preguntó si nos gusta bailar. Uh -huh. Ya, uh -huh. ya le contestamos cada uno, sí, 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 va. Entonces, ya para finalizar la última pregunta sería, eh, ¿Do you go to dance on Saturday? Eh, ¿Van a ir a bailar el sábado? O sea, como le vamos a contestar que sí todos, pues pregunta, ah, y va, van a ir a bailar el sábado. Entonces le vamos a decir sí, 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 va. Entonces usted dice, ok, eh, see you later, ok, nos vemos, nos vemos. O sea, no, solo nos vemos, ok. ¿Y por qué no le preguntamos pero cómo sería esa pregunta? Porque es curioso. Vaya, <risa> vaya. Teacher. No, poner la campana. No, pero bueno. I'm here, <risa> Yes. Uh, teacher, eh, bueno, se la voy a preguntar yo, Anita. Eh, bueno. Teacher, eh, es perfecto. Eh, do you go to dance on Saturday? Yes, it is good. It is a good question because you say, do you do you do you do you dance? You said first, right? And then you say, do you dance? You go dance on Saturday? That's good. Uh -huh. Tell me, Anna. Pero, teacher, si yo les quiero preguntar a ellos. Eh, yo ya les pregunté si les gusta bailar y me dijeron uh -huh. que sí. Uh -huh. Entonces yo les quiero invitar a ellos, vamos a bailar el sábado. Oh, Entonces, okay. ¿cómo sería la pregunta? If you want Usando, to, yes. If you want to make an yes. invitation, if you want to make an invitation, you want, you want to say, do you want to go dance? And, On Saturday. Saturday. This is a question. Mm -hmm. You want to go dance on Saturday? This is an invitation. Now, another way to say it, and it's sh a shorter way, we can say, let's go. Let's go dancing. Let's go dancing on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Esa sería una afirmación y también es una, un, es una invitación. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, let's go. Eh, teacher, otra, teacher mm -hmm. otra, pre otra pregunta. Yes. Eh, estamos con la, con la, en el debate acá de que él nos va a preguntar a nosotros. Mm -hmm. Entonces, eh, como nos va a preguntar a nosotros, eh, se va a ocupar auxiliar yo entonces, porque este, aunque. Exactly. Aunque, mm -hmm. ah, okay, yes. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. y, y el auxiliar your, ¿para qué se ocupa entonces, teacher? Your. Your, ajá. Es possessive. What is, uh, what is your what is your uh, name? Yes, your what's that say? Okay, okay. Yes, okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay. Vaya, señores. Uh, eh, si quiere practicar. Practiquemos ahora otra vez. Vaya. Eh, bueno, entonces usted dice. Eh, hello, can I? Eh, hello, Anita. How are you? Eh, fine. Pero mire, Anita, hagámoslo así como que así como que realmente estuviéramos viéndonos así cara a cara, va. How are you? Fine. Ya. <risa> ya. <risa> ya. Ok. Eh, comencemos. Hello, can drive. Hello, Anita. How are you? Fine. Eh, Anita, okay. eh, they are uh, my friend Fabricio and yours. Nice to meet you, Fabricio and yours. Nice to meet you, Ana. Ana. Um, Vaya, Fabricio, entramos aquí, ya. Eh, Ana, do you at work at Aeroman? Yes, I do. Jorge, 
do you do at work every day, Anna? Uh, I I give a grad maintenance. Okay. Ahí le preguntamos otra vez, Jorge, que si limpia aviones. Ah, sí, yo limpio, ajá. ajá, ajá. Do, you, do you clean the aircraft? No, I do. Eh, de ahí le pregunto por Fabricio, ¿verdad? Ajá, usted, usted no, usted le pregunta directamente a Fabricio. Fabricio, eh, ajá. Do you study English? Eh, yes, I do. And you, Ana, study English? Welcome back, welcome back. We're waiting for the other classmates. They're coming back to the main session. Okay. Okay, everyone's back. All right, let's see. We're going to start checking your conversations. And the first group to go is Fernando, Javier, and Ruben. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Ready. Action. Go. Good yeah. morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Fernando. Good morning, Javi. Good morning, Ruben. How are you? Very good, very good, Fernando. How are you, Javi? I am fine, Fernando. Yes, so. Good. What is your position to work, Fernando? I am position in acting supervisor. Ah, very good, Fernando. Very good. What activity do you do, you do at work, Fernando? I coordinate the avionic and system group and send chief work report by email at the end of the shift, Ruben. Ah, okay. I coordinate group system avionic, Fernando. Yes, I do. Ah, very good. Do you do you store do you store tools in box, Fernando? Mm, no, I don't ruin. Ah, okay. Very good, Fernando. Very good. Javi. Hi. Where are you your position in the world? I I storekeeper. Ah, storekeeper. Okay, very good. What activity do you do at work? I retore I retore tools. I review calibration tool. Okay, very good. Do you as this thing mechanic, Javi? No, I don't. Oh, do you a uh, review calibration tool, Javi? Yes, I. Yes, I do. Okay, very good. Fine, fine. Next. Finished? No, next. Okay. No, next. No. Okay. No, falta Ruben. Hi, Ruben. Hi, Javi. Hi. What is your position at work? Ah, uh, system mechanical, Javi. System mechanic. Why is your uh, routine in at work? Ah, uh, routine is I clean my area. I read the job cards, Javi. <laughs> do you read job cards? Yes, I do, Javi. Yes, I do. Do you a storekeeper? Ah, no, I don't. No, I do, Javi. No, I do. Okay. Nice to meet you, Fernando. Nice to meet you, Ruben. Nice to meet you, Javi. Bye. Bye, bye. Thank you very much, people. <laughs> okay. okay. Very good job. Very good. Very good. Okay. Now, 
A few observations. I have a few observations. Let's see. Let me let me copy paste this information here. No observation. Oh, okay. <laughs> no observations. <laughs> <laughs> We're working on that. We're working on that. Someday there will be no observations. You will see. Okay. Mm -hmm. So these are my these are my observations here. Okay. So in this case, the first one is, what is your 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 job position, right? Job position. What is your job position? One more time, everybody. Mm -hmm. What is your job position? What is your what is your job position? What is your position? What is okay. your position? Uh -huh. And then when you said activities at work, you said I coordinate the avionics the avionics group the avionics group repeat the avionics group the avionics avionics, avionics, avionics group. group okay next you said you said i store keeper but the right way to say it is i'm repeat i'm i'm, I'm a storekeeper a storekeeper store store okay now take a look at this question here do you do you a system mechanics? Okay. La semana pasada estudiamos el verbo to be. ¿Se recuerdan? ¿Para qué tipo de información ocupamos el verbo to be? Ser o estar. Ser o estar, ¿verdad? Ok. En este caso, esta es una pregunta de ser o estar. Yo le estoy preguntando si él es un systems mechanic, right? Entonces, si ser o estar es para expresar esos dos verbos en español, el verbo to be, entonces... Tengo que ocupar el verbo to be en esta pregunta. Pues, eh, ser o estar no es un verbo de acción como los que estamos practicando eh, en estas últimas clases que hemos tenido esta semana. Por ejemplo, un verbo de acción es correr, dormir, trabajar. ¿Ok? Entonces, si ustedes se recuerdan, tenemos dos claves para poder identificar cuándo ocupar el verbo to be. Tenemos occupations. ¿Ok? And a systems mechanic is an occupation, yes or no? Yes. 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 So, in this case, this is the type of information. Si aquí tengo una ocupación, voy a ocupar el verbo to be para hacer una pregunta. Entonces, acuérdense, el do es un auxiliar solamente para verbos de acción. Y como systems mechanic no es un verbo de acción, ¿cuál, cuál es el auxiliar que voy a ocupar? R. Yes, R. You. A systems mechanic. Javi? Very good. Okay, repeat the question. Are you a systems mechanic, Javi? Are you a system mechanic? Are you a system mechanic? Uh -huh. Are you a systems mechanic? Very good. Now, the the other one over here. Storekeeper. What type of information is storekeeper? Occupation. Occupation. So we're going to say Are, are, are you, you are you? Are you a storekeeper? Aha. Uh -huh. Are you a storekeeper? And the answer, and the answer is? No, I don't. I. No. You say no. no. I am. No. Uh -huh. I, I'm. No. Aha. Uh -huh. No, I'm not. Because this is verb to be, right? Esto es cero estar. No, no lo soy. So, no, I'm not. Very good. Okay. Now, escuché una pregunta de, de un verbo de acción y querían decir no. But in this case, no, I do. I do is for a positive answer. So, negative, no? Don't. I don't. Yes, no, I don't. Very good, very good. Okay. Recuerden, las observaciones nos ayudan a identificar las áreas de oportunidad para que la próxima... Nos podamos mejorar. Okay. It's okay. It's okay to make mistakes. Está bien equivocarse. Está muy bien. Porque estamos aprendiendo. Okay. So, great job. The rest of the information was awesome. Let's continue with the next group. Let's see. We're going to check Ana, Fabrizio, Herbert, and Jorge. Go ahead. Hello, Herbert. How are you? Bye. 
Micrófono, con like, micrófono. Excuse me. Eh, hello, Anita. Hi. Eh, Anita, eh, they are my friend, Fabricio and George. Nice to meet you, Fabricio and George. Nice to meet you too, Ana. Ana, do you adore Iron Man? Yes, I do. Do you do at work every day, Anna? I give aircraft maintenance. Do you clean the aircraft, Anna? No, I do. I don't. No, I don't. Uh, Fabricio, do you study English? Yes, I do. And you, Anna? You study English? Yes, I do. Uh, do you like to dance, uh, Fabricio Candray and her? Yes, I do. Yes, yes I, I do. do. Let's go dancing on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let's go. She's very smart. See you on Saturday. <laughs> See you, See Saturday. you Saturday. Saturday. Bye. 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 Okay, good job. She knows why she's learning English. Very good. Okay. Now, observations, pronunciation. Do you work at Aeroman? Do you work at? Do you work at? Do you work, Do you work at? at? Do you Aeroman. Aeroman. Okay, very good. Esa es una pregunta que la vamos a practicar la otra semana. Cuando decimos el lugar de trabajo, vamos a usar una preposición específica y esa es at para decir siempre el lugar de trabajo at do you work at aeroman do you work at vidri do you work at super selectos okay now next what do you do at work repeat what do you do at work what do you do, what at, do, you do, at, do work? at work perfect very good okay the last group is david and hector are you ready yeah. Ready. Three, two, one, action. Hi, Hector. Hi, Christian. Hi. Hi. Hi How are, How are you? you? How are you, Hector? I'm fine. Oh, good, good. How are you, Christian? I'm fine. And you, okay. how are you? Hi, good, I'm good. Christian. Do you clean your work area? Yes, I do. Victor. Yes. Victor. Sí, sí. Does David coordinate the Bionics group? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. David. David, does Christian keep on record of tool? No, he doesn't. Christian, does Hector read a jo the Joker? Yes, he does. And Hector, do we study English today? Yes, we do. David, does Christian deliver material? No, he doesn't. Oh, okay. Nice to meet you, Hector. Nice to meet you, too. Nice to meet you, Christian. Nice to meet you, too. Okay, very good, very good. All right, very good. All right, Not now, great job, no observations. Now, an observation for everybody. This word, I'm sending you a message, aircraft. This one sounds like eh, air, air, air aircraft. The letter, uh, the letter A and the I sound like air, aircraft. Okay, very good job, very good. Okay, look, remember, this is a general observation for everybody. Now, Hemos estudiado este tema por partes, que okay. la semana pasada nos dedicamos solo al verbo to be, 
pero entre la semana pasada y esta hemos visto el simple present, el presente simple. ¿Para qué nos sirve el simple present? What type of information? For? Describe the action. Ajá, very good, very good. Describe actions and routine. Very good, okay, very good. Okay, actions and routine, okay. ¿Qué verbos hay en el simple present? Tenemos el verb to be, ok. Y tenemos action verbs. Ok. Ok. So, verb to be, you, you know it has two meanings, right? We have this, right? Ok. And action verbs. Any other... Action. Cualquier otra acción que no sea cero está, right? Okay. So, what information do I use with the verb to be? I use, remember this word? Adjectives. Repeat, adjectives. Adjectives and occupations. Okay, occupations. Okay. Now, Ahora, hasta este punto hemos aprendido que el verbo to be lo ocupamos con adjetivos <coughs> y ocupaciones. What are some examples of adjectives? We saw some adjectives in previous classes. For example, when I say big, other examples? No. Yes, very good. Tall. Uh, Tall. What's the other one? Sure. Yes, very good. Ok, those are adjectives. Los adjetivos nos ayudan a darle un atributo a algo. Yo opino algo acerca de alguien o de una cosa, right? Now, occupations. Examples of occupations. Doctor. Doctor, uh -huh, very good. Avionics what? Avionics? Mechanic. Very good, very good. Perfect, you see? Ok, si yo voy a hablar de cualquiera de este tipo de información, ok, yo voy a ocupar el verbo to be. Now, action <coughs> verbs, for example, daily routine, daily routine. Actions? Get up to meeting. Ok, very good. Go to a meeting. You see, all those action verbs, I have to use the structure. Take yes. a shower. Very good, very good. Okay. Okay. Si yo voy a hablar de este tipo de información, adjetivos, ocupaciones, voy a hablar del verbo to be. Si yo voy a hablar de verbos de acción, voy a ocupar la estructura de do or does para las preguntas y la conjugación de verbos en las oraciones positivas o negativas. Aquí... Para este, vamos a ocupar la estructura que aprendimos la semana pasada. Vamos a abrirla rápidamente. Ok. ¿Se acuerdan de este documento? Vamos a verlo. Aquí está. Ok. Vamos a ver. ¿Lo pueden ver el documento? Give me one second. Ok, si se fijan en el documento, tenemos simple present verb to be. This is the, the structure for question, for, for affirmative sentences, negative sentences, and questions. Yes? ¿Se recuerdan de ese documento? Yes? Ok, so, yes. esta es toda la información que se ocupa con el verb to be. Si yo hablo de adjetivos y ocupaciones, todavía no hemos hablado de places, de los lugares vamos a hablar la otra semana. Ok, so. ¿Qué es lo que tenemos que hacer? Repasar. Ustedes ahorita solo llevan dos semanas. Tienen que hacer de esto una rutina. Así como ustedes se lavan los dientes, se bañan, comen, así tenemos que dedicarle tiempo a repasar lo que vemos en cada sesión. Todo el trabajo que hicimos la semana pasada hay que repasarlo a diario. Yo me tengo que as asegurar de que yo lo que ya es estudié lo, lo tengo claro. Eso que ya pasó está aquí, pero yo tengo que repasarlo. ¿Por qué? Porque el, el, el aprender un idioma es acumulativo. Tiene, lo que usted aprendió hoy le va a servir el siguiente año, la siguiente semana. Eso es algo que se tiene que quedar usted con ello. Entonces, 
cómo se encarga uno de que el cerebro se recuerde de eso con la práctica. Así que es repetitivo. Hay que, hay que darle a lo mismo todos los días para asegurarnos que no se nos olvide. Mañana vamos a, a hacer una práctica combinando verbo to be y verbos de acción. ¿okay? Porque el lunes ya tenemos nuestro primer examen que es de las dos semanas eh, del, que llevamos del módulo. Eso va a ser hasta el lunes. ¿okay? Así que mañana vamos a seguir practicando, no se preocupen. Sus tareas son práctica extra que les ayudan a reforzar los temas que vamos en clase. Así que si ustedes se hacen de eso una, una rutina, como por ejemplo más noche, 15 minutos, usted se siente y dice, ay, ¿qué aprendí en la clase de hoy? Me voy a recordar. O le, o le puede explicar a alguien más también. Entonces, eso es algo que le ayuda a usted a recordar los temas que ya vio. Así que eh, es una recomendación. Siempre repasemos lo que vemos en clases pasadas y vamos a, bueno, ¿tienen alguna pregunta de la clase de hoy? No. En la clase de hoy hicieron un excelente trabajo. Todas las preguntas, respuestas en todos los sujetos estuvieron excelentes. Siempre hay cosas que se pueden mejorar, pero para eso está la retroalimentación. Ustedes siempre tomen en cuenta los, la, la retroalimentación para las futuras actividades. Great job, guys. I'm very happy with the results. Okay, let's see. Let's check attendance, all right? Before we finish the class, we're going to check for attendance. Okay, so here we go. Let's see. Hector Alvarado? It's here. Very good. Okay. Herbert Candray? Present. Ana Dominguez? Present. Javier Ernesto? Present. Christian Fuentes? Present. Very good. Ruben Garcia? Ruben? Present. Okay, very good. Okay, then uh, David Hernandez? Present. Very good. Okay. Nelson Hugo? Okay, Nelson asked me for permission because he had a medical medical appointment. Okay. Christian Lopez? Christian Lopez was here in the beginning of the class, but he had to go. Mestizo. Okay. Fernando Orellana? Present. Very good. Gustavo Parada is not here. Jorge Ramirez? Present. Very good. And Herbert Rivera. Present. Very good. Okay, very good, guys. So, let's keep up with the great job you are doing. Estamos haciendo un excelente trabajo. Okay, repasemos verbos. Acuérdense, los verbos son el vocabulario que yo ocupo para expresarme. Si yo sé verbos, yo sé cómo armar mis ideas cuando yo quiero expresar algo. Okay? So, okay. todo el material está en Schoology. Todo está ahí en la carpeta que dice class material, todo, todo, igual todo se los he mandado al WhatsApp, ustedes tienen el material, manténganlo en una forma ordenada para que ustedes sepan a dónde ir para buscar la información, ¿ok? See you tomorrow, okay. take care, tomorrow. bye, 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 b